gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time for fun with Chucky's awesome adventure machine. Hello there, everybody. Oh, hi, kids. How you doing? Oh, I'd like to introduce myself, but shucks, that's my name right over the door. What, your name is Exit? Oh. Oh. Exit. <laughs> no, my name isn't Exit. <laughs> I mean, my name is over the door on the way in. Oh. I'm Chuck E. Cheese, singer, dancer, athlete, entertainer, and now an inventor. Presenting my awesome adventure machine. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That sure is something. Where did you learn so much about science, Chucky? Well, I don't want to brag, but my uncle was a famous lab rat. Gosh. You know, your adventure machine sort of looks like a TV. Well, it started as a TV, but the girls and boys here told me what sort of adventures they'd like to have, and I put all sorts of gadgets and gizmos and fancy computer stuff inside to make it work. What, there's computers in that thing? Oh, sure. The adventure machine has got lots of computer stuff in it. Yep, we're right out there on the computer frontier. Hey, is that anything like the Wild West frontier? Hmm, it could be, could be. Jasper, you've just given me a great idea. Oh? Well, it's a first time for everything. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if everyone here will use a little imagination and watch my adventure machine, we'll see what happens when the computer frontier meets the Wild West. Instead of guns, they all have CPUs. Which brings us around to the legend of two high-tech times and the girl they love. The day they met, one of them had to lose. Two computer cowboys, only one could be the best. At the Silicon Valley showdown, past his mouse in the world. Silicon Valley Saloon, Pasquale the Kid was playing Doom and racking up an all-time real high score. When suddenly something blocked the sun, it was Wyatt Burp, the only one whose shaggy figure could have filled that door. I was looking for a certain female, name of Helen, met her on email, thought I'd like to log on for a chat. Pasquale the Kid showed a sinister smile and said, You can just delete that file. This database queen won't date a desert rat. They looked at Helen. She sure was pretty. Playing a piano program with Minnie. Smart and sweet. Of that, there was no doubt. Bart said, Yet I'm not fooling. And my laptop's loaded and ready for dueling. You and I are gonna have to shoot this out. Two computer cowboys. Only one could be the best. At the Silicon Valley showdown, fastest mouse in the West. How cool! The squally the kid sipped his pizza sauce and said, Friend, I can kick your dust. No man alive can top my processor speed. Maybe you've had a lot of practice pointing that cursor at a bunch of cactus, but I'll blow you away like you were a tumbleweed. I've just come from a real hard drive, said Boyd. And there's not a man alive. With a system whose kilohertz I cannot give. So just let the lady come with me. You keep your finger away from that function key. You boot up and you're going to boot hill. The Smalley said, This is a real small town, so one of us is getting powered down. We'll center this outside when it hits high noon. Helen opened an Indian totem, revealing her powerful high speed modem. A message said, Send help and send it soon. Computer cowboys, only one could be the best At the Silicon Valley showdown, fastest mouse in the West ow, 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 ow. Out in the street, the dust and wind blows People go running and shut down the windows Wyatt boy straightens his hat with a steady paw It's time to log off Pasquale quips as the sun sparkles on his silicon chips Both men smile and then they both say Draw! Two mics were drawn just like lightning, but as quick with fingers tightening, hard to say which one of them was first. But when the floppies all were fired, no one was hurt or even tired. That's when Sheriff G 
Joseph. You're the worst. The fastest mouse in all the land has already won Helen Hitty's hand. That mouse is me. He told me with a frown. Then in a blaze of megabytes. 